Loaded up with stolen backpacks and no one around to stop them. Police say two thieves snuck into a Fort Worth High School campus. Tonight, the suspects are still on the run after stealing a student's car. But the crime is raising some bigger concerns about school safety. That theft that was reported last week, Chisholm Trail High School. News Ace David Goins looked into how this could happen. They look like a couple of students walking down the hall of their high school. But Fort Worth police say these two aren't students and this isn't their high school. And those backpacks they're holding, yeah, those aren't theirs either. Detectives say the pair made off with multiple students' bags and then stole a student's car from the parking lot at Chisholm Trail High School. While police want an arrest, a school safety expert sees a larger glaring problem. If by having use of the facility, can they gain access to the rest of the building or other areas that are really should be off limits? John Matthews is a public safety consultant and says the challenge of securing buildings during after school activities is one many districts face. Eagle Mountain Saginaw ISD says the campus was hosting a gymnastics event and the security breach didn't happen during school hours. We asked Eagle Mountain Saginaw ISD about school security here at Chisholm Trail High School, even when kids are not in class. They declined an on-camera interview. The school is responsible and must do due diligence in where those people have access to. Somebody just comes into a school. I mean, isn't there any safety? Patty Del Real says she first saw the video on Facebook and admitted building safety as a parent at all times remains top of mind for her. Even if it's after school or, or whatever, you know, it's scary. Police believe the thieves are in their late teens or early 20s and hope this clear video helps find them. In Fort Worth, David Goins, Channel 8 News.